Augusta National History is filled with giants. But the game's legends aren't the only outsized presence to have shaped this club's storied past. For nearly 80 years, a 60-foot-tall loblolly pine known as Ike's Tree stood sentry on the left side of the 17th fairway. The tree was named after Augusta National member Dwight Eisenhower because it seemed to constantly be in his line of fire. For years, he lobbied to have it removed, to no avail. But in February of 2014, an ice storm accomplished what the world's once most powerful man could not. The tree came down, changing the hole's identity forever. I didn't play last year, so I didn't see when Eisenhower Tree was gone. I didn't realize 17 was straight ahead. Uh, I always thought it was a little bit of a dog leg left. It's eye-opening to see this, it's just dead straight. After it fell, its trunk and branches were removed, but something so closely associated with two pieces of American history, Augusta National and the nation's 34th president, lives on in legend and now beyond. We have been challenged to create an appropriate, lasting memory of this tree because we wanted to make a special gift to the Eisenhower Presidential Library and to create a permanent legacy here at Augusta National. So I'm pleased now to present this beautiful cross section of the Eisenhower tree. And while we know the Eisenhower tree is irreplaceable, in terms of its historical significance, I am pleased to announce that we have been successful so far in preserving this famous tree's genetics. What you now see are three surviving and so far thriving results of two successful grafts and one seedling of the Eisenhower tree. For now, we as a membership, we watch, we wait, and we remember all of the many great stories surrounding this revered part of our history.